If you use many USB pen drives for many operating systems, one for Windows, one for Linux, one for Android, one for personal data, it costs you more money and take more time to burn one by another. Isn't it convenient if you can do all these tasks using only one pen drive? So watch this video to make this magical pen drive. Before I go to the main part, make sure that you have subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon so let's go to the computer screen Open your internet browser and go to www.github.com slash ventoy slash ventoy slash releases. Click on ventoy 10.12 windows.zip to download for Windows. Because I am using Windows 10. If you are a Linux user, then download ventoy 10.12 linux.gzip. Go to download folder and extract the zip file. Now right click on the extracted folder and open. And the Ventoy disk software is here. Plug USB disk in your computer and format it. Make sure you do not have any important data or file on that USB drive before formatting. My pen drive has 64 GB of storage capacity. You should use a larger capacity of pen drive if you want to put more and more large ISO files. Go to the extracted folder and run the Ventoy disk. Click on update to check and get the earlier update from Ventoy disk developer. When updating is done, select your pen drive and click on install. It is done and your Ventoy disk is ready. Close Ventoy disk. Now I am going to copy all ISO files from my computer to Ventoy disk. These are the ISO files on my computer. There are several ISOs of Windows, Linux Mint, Android Bliss, Zorin OS, and Heron's Boot CD. 
Ventoy Disk is a small software of 3.85 MB. It's 100% open source and very fast and simple to use. It supports legacy and UEFI. Also supports UEFI secure boot and persistence. It can be booted from WIM files. More than 260 ISO files are tested successfully. It boots from ISO files directly without extraction. When copying is done, restart your computer. Boot from USB drive. Here's the Ventar disk with a list of ISO files. Now I will show you booting from several ISO files. 